Hi, I'm Tim from ZeroKey, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to set up the Quantum RTLS Starter Kit. This video will cover the standard setup procedure for both the PoE and the Universal Starter Kits. Quantum RTLS is the world's most accurate industrial positioning system, and once you're familiar with the steps involved, you can be set up and calibrated in a matter of minutes in any environment. Let's get started. Begin by removing the anchors, mobiles, and the gateway from your starter kit. The Universal Starter Kit includes eight UAR10 rechargeable anchors, and the PoE Starter Kit includes eight EAP10 Power Over Ethernet anchors. If taken apart for transport, thread the removable antenna to the connector on the gateway. The anchor and mobile nodes have a nearly identical external form factor. The mobiles have a blue grill on the front of the device, while the anchors have a gray grill. They have a power button on the side, a micro USB port for charging, and an LED status indicator light. The circle on the front here is our ultrasonic transducer, the center of which is where all our measurements are taken from. Before beginning installation, ensure all the mobile devices are fully charged. If you're using the Universal Starter Kit, it's also necessary to charge the UAR10 anchor devices as well. Connect the devices via micro USB to the included charging hub. The Starter Kit includes several mounting accessories for the anchors. In this video, we'll be mounting the anchors to tripods for demonstration purposes. However, they can also be mounted directly to walls or placed on available structures. Turn the anchors on by pressing the button once. With the PoE Starter Kit, the anchors are daisy-chained from the included PoE injector and will automatically turn on when powered up. The power input is on the right side of the anchor, and the power output is on the left. You can connect up to 10 devices on a single chain. Using the provided USB-C cable, connect the gateway to your computer. And with the ZeroKey config tool open, the gateway will automatically be detected, at which point you can click Connect to continue setup. Next, click Anchor Calibration and launch the interactive ZeroKey Calibration Wizard. Place the anchors around the circumference of the area you want to position. For best results, point the anchors towards the center of the area and vary the height slightly between anchors. The PoE anchors have an adjustable transducer, which can be manipulated for better coverage of the positioning area. If possible, configure the anchors in an octagon shape, avoiding situations where any three anchors are in a straight line with one another. With anchors deployed, you're ready to continue to Step 2. Step 2 automatically begins node discovery. Make sure exactly eight anchors and one mobile are found. This can take up to one minute as nodes may have entered a sleep mode. With all nodes discovered, you're ready to continue calibration. Place the mobile on the ground in the center of the anchors with clear line of sight from the mobile to all anchors. Click Start and walk around the space slowly, with the mobile held at arm's length away from your body. During this step, the system will collect measurements from multiple locations throughout the space to determine the anchor's exact coordinates. Once all anchors have collected 100% of their necessary measurements, an alarm will chime. Place the mobile back in the center of the anchors and continue to step four. The final processing involves communication between all the anchor nodes. So while this takes place, we wanna make sure the area is kept clear of people or moving objects. Congratulations, your starter kit is now calibrated and ready to use. You can optionally perform a scale check to validate the accuracy of the calibration. Scale check requires two mobile nodes. Once the second mobile node is detected, the calculated distance between the two mobiles will be displayed on screen. Using a tape measure, place the mobiles exactly one meter apart, measured from the center of the ultrasonic transducers. Once the nodes are placed, click Record. Then, rotate the setup 90 degrees and take another measurement. Both measurements should be close to one meter. Once calibrated successfully, 
you can navigate to the General tab and click Start Positioning. In the 3D Visualizer, you'll see the position of the anchors and the mobile in real time. To access the system within the Spatial Intelligence platform, disconnect the gateway from your computer and plug it into the Zero Key Edge Compute device. When turned on without a hardwired Ethernet connection, the Edge Compute device will automatically boot up as a wireless access point and can be connected by joining its Wi-Fi network. In a browser, navigate to the Edge Compute device's Edge URL, which is the serial number located on the bottom of the device, .edge.zerokey.com. This will launch the Spatial Intelligence Platform's dashboard, where you can sign in with your provided credentials. Thanks for watching. I hope this video has helped you get your starter kit up and running successfully. For more information, resources, and support, visit our website, zerokey.com.